Hello everyone, I'm writer coach Tony and I'm in a movie review binge. Um, I'm doing vintage movies and right now I'm doing the third movie in the series. It's Sex and the City, the original movie. So just like many of those who were in the knots time, the zero zeros, uh, Sex and the City in HBO was the show to watch, especially for those um, who loved fashion and who loved New York who love sex, who love living life, no? and um, in a way, Sex and the City, the, the series, uh, strongly influenced my life in a way that uh, it taught me how to dress up, present myself to people, uh, to be more um, forward with other people in terms of um, my feelings for them. So, in a way, although the series is written in a woman's point of view, also helped uh, younger young gay men like me when I was at that time I was um, hmm, year 2000 I was 29 so I was in my 30s so throughout that decade I was in my 30s and uh, that series helped me a lot so successful series we turned into a movie and um, yes I remember the movie and when I watched it um, I think the second time around, I felt more anger towards Bing, you know, because of what he did. Because what he did is really stupid, it's unforgivable. But of course, this is not just a movie. Um, they did reconcile no? in the end. But um, that was a part of the movie that was a bit dramatic, no? Um, Carrie uh, being snubbed in her own wedding. After she uh, attends um, yeah. after she um, gets stood up in her, in her church wedding, um, I strongly suggest, you know, especially for younger people now, if you're in your 30s, 20s, you're a teenager, um, this movie is a good bookmark of the past no? because it talks about fashion and then um, if you watch the movie almost every shot is a fashion shot it's very nice to watch um, although I don't think it's realistic but um, because all of them are clothes horses no? I mean <laughs> you know just how tiring it would be to think of your outfit every day uh, nowadays though it's updated we already do the Hashtag OOTD, no? Out, outfit of the day. So, but before, people just dress up in their best pieces, and that's their hashtag OOTD. Um, it helps so that they were younger, and then their nice clothes can still fit. So, that's a big plus for them, no? Uh, the OOTD. Um, let's go back to the movie. <laughs> we digressed a bit. Um, the movie's enjoyable to watch you know, because um, I think that uh, Ryan Murphy, you know, the director, tried his best to um, fully realize the stories of all the four women in the movie, in the TV series. So although they had to share, to share the same movie time, cinema time, um, I think it was, judicious, it was judiciously um, shared between each actress. Um, Samantha, yeah, she was with Jared, and then, um, yeah, uh, Miranda was with the carpenter, yes, that was that part they had this debate about relationships, I think, and then, who's the fourth one that was my favorite? Who's me, actually, I forgot her name, um, but she her husband is the jew jewish husband and in the beginning of the movie uh her character had a dilemma because the au pair she got had was well endowed so she was you know well when she moved her and was also moving but it turns out that she was also played for the other team that she was also a lesbian um I think if I were to choose, uh, just watch the series. No? Uh, the movie is, um, 
Yeah, it's a bit long-winded. But it's fun to watch naman. For fun lang. But if you really want to get to know these girls, um, I suggest you watch the series. Uh, do not watch the movie if you don't watch the series because you wouldn't understand uh, where these women are coming from and why they act this way, why they make these decisions, why they dress that way. No? Otherwise, if you go to the movie and then you, s um, you know already their story in, in the TV series Sex in the City, then I'm sure you'll have a great time um, watching the movie. So, thank you very much for watching my movie vlog. Movie vintage movie vlog. Uh, please subscribe. Uh, please like my Facebook, my Twitter, and my Instagram, and subscribe to my channel, Writer Coach Tony. Thank you very much. Um, another movie review coming. So take care, everyone. Bye.